What if the key to understanding the very genesis of our species, the origin story of every human alive today, wasn't hidden in a fossil but resides within the DNA of a people living right now? A people whose language is among the most complex on Earth and whose ancestry branches off our shared family tree deeper and earlier than any other. This is the story of the Khoisan peoples of Southern Africa, a story that takes us back to the dawn of Homo sapiens and challenges everything we thought we knew about where we come from. Welcome to SCI Discovery Chronicles. Today, we journey to the sun-drenched landscapes of the Kalahari and beyond to explore the incredible genetic legacy of humanity's oldest lineage. We will uncover tales of ancient ghost populations, rewrite the map of human migration, and confront the profound questions of what it truly means to be human. For millennia, the diverse peoples known collectively as the Khoisan have been the inhabitants of Southern Africa. They are broadly comprised of the San, traditionally hunter-gatherers, and the Koko, traditionally pastoralists. Their most famous characteristic is their use of click consonants, intricate sounds woven into their languages that are found almost nowhere else on the planet. For centuries, they were viewed by outsiders through a distorted lens, but modern science is now revealing the truth. The Khoisan are not a relic of the past. They are a modern people who hold a living library of ancient human diversity within their very genes. To understand why, we must travel back in time to the very root of the human family tree. Genetic analysis has revealed a staggering fact the Khoisan lineage represents the earliest known divergence among modern humans. Sometime between 100,000 and 200,000 years ago, their ancestors split from the ancestors of all other living people. Think of the human population as a mighty river. The Khoisan are the first major channel to branch off and they have flowed on their own unique course ever since. This ancient split has profound implications. When a small group of Homo sapiens migrated out of Africa around 60,000 years ago, they carried only a fraction of the total human genetic diversity with them. This is known as a genetic bottleneck. But the Khoisan ancestors, who remained in southern Africa, never passed through this bottleneck. As a result, they have retained an astonishing level of genetic variation, far greater than that found in most other world populations. Their DNA is a time capsule, preserving a record of humanity's ancient genetic landscape that was lost to the rest of the world. But their story becomes even more profound when we look deeper not just at their own lineage but at who their ancestors may have met on their ancient journey. Recent genetic studies, from 2012 up to today, have uncovered something extraordinary, evidence of interbreeding with a now extinct archaic human population within Africa. Just as many known Africans carry Neanderthal DNA, it appears the ancestors of the Khoisan mixed with an even more mysterious ghost population. We have no fossils of these ancient people, no name for them, only their genetic echoes, which make up a small but significant part of the Khoisan genome. This discovery revolutionizes our understanding, suggesting that the story of different human species intermingling was not limited to Eurasia but was a fundamental part of our evolution across the African continent as well. The genetic history of the Khoisan is not just one of ancient isolation. It is also a story of more recent dynamic change. Around 3,000 years ago, a massive migration began to sweep across Africa. The Banda-speaking peoples, originating from West Central Africa, expanded south and east, bringing agriculture and iron working with them. When they arrived in Southern Africa, they encountered the Khoisan. What followed was a complex period of cultural exchange, conflict, and intermarriage. Today, the genetic legacy of this Bantu expansion is visible in nearly all Khoisan populations and conversely, Khoisan ancestry, particularly their click consonants, has been integrated into some Bantu languages like Kosa and Zulu. This shows that the Khoisan, like all peoples, have a rich and evolving history of interaction and adaptation. The unique position of the Khoisan lineage, along with the discoveries of Neanderthal and Denisovan DNA, forces us to ask a fundamental biological question, what really defines a species? 
In biology, the classic definition of a species is a group of organisms that can interbreed and produce fertile offspring. We know that Homo sapiens interbred with Neanderthals, Denisovans, and now we see evidence that our African ancestors interbred with other archaic ghost populations. However, some genetic analyzes suggest that the offspring of these pairings, particularly the male hybrids, may have had reduced fertility. This could mean that while we were close enough to interbreed, there were still biological barriers between us. We were at the very edge of the species definition, a fascinating gray area that science is still fiercely debating. The Cozen story provides a crucial piece of this puzzle, showing how different human groups could remain largely separate for over 100,000 years, yet still come back together. For decades, the story of the Cozen was often told by outsiders, and their genetic material was sometimes collected without proper consent or collaboration. This legacy of colonial science has left deep scars. But today, the field is undergoing a crucial ethical transformation. New research is increasingly being led in partnership with the Cozen communities themselves. They are no longer just subjects of study, but active participants and guardians of their own history, helping to guide the research and ensure that the story of their incredible past is told with the respect and accuracy it deserves. This collaborative approach is the only way forward, ensuring that the scientific discoveries benefit and empower the very people who hold these genetic keys to our shared past. So, we arrive at the end of our journey, back at the root of the human story. The Koizen are not living fossils, but a vibrant, modern people who carry within them the deep extruding genetic lineage known to humanity. Their DNA is a testament to our species' true cradle in Africa, a library of ancient diversity. It holds the echoes of ghost populations we are yet to identify and tells a story of survival, adaptation, and interaction over hundreds of thousands of years. They show us that the simple out-of-Africa tree is in fact a complex, braided stream with many ancient sources flowing into the river of modern humanity. The secrets they hold are, in essence, our own deepest secrets. By understanding their past, we gain an unparalleled insight into the origin of us all. Thank you for joining us on SCI Discovery Chronicles. If this journey to the dawn of humanity has sparked your curiosity, be sure to subscribe to our channel, like this video, and share it with others who are passionate about the human story. Click the notification bell so you won't miss our next scientific adventure. What aspect of the Koizen's ancient legacy do you find most astonishing? Let us know in the comments below. Until next time, keep questioning, keep exploring.